Bernardo! Samantha Bernardo! Samantha Bernardo! Ladies and gentlemen, please Dami welcome na Samantha na pagdaanan. Bernardo! Ngayon pa ba tayo susuko, Pilipinas? Samber and this is the sum up. We are down to our 10th episode at marami salamat sa inyong support at let us welcome the year of the dragon enjoying, learning and kahit papano sana you guys are inspired by all the shows and of course sa lahat ng mga content na ginawa natin dito. But syempre, hindi matatapos ang taong ito na hindi tayo ginigrace by another beauty na talaga namang niyanig ang universe sa kanyang taglay na ganda at charm. My Binibini Sister at Binibini Pilipinas Universe 2019, Miss Gazzini Gananas! Ayan, talaga namang napakaganda ni Gazzini. How are you, babe? Babe, okay lang. Ito, thriving in 2024. Happy New Year pala sa'yo. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Talaga namang we welcome natin ang Feb Month with Rat and Year the, of the Dragon yeah. color. color of the Year. So dapat suswertihin tayo sa ating pag-ibig. Oh. Yes, and sa year na to. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alam mo na. Alam. Anyway, <laughs> salamat naman for making time and we are so honored that you here. For sure, ang dami mong commitments. And I'm sure ito na nga, maraming mga netizens ang nagtatanong kung kamusta ba ang puso ng isang gandini ganados dahil fem-ibig na. May ganun? Yes. <laughs> Okay naman, sobrang taba ng puso ko kasi maraming mga tao sumusuporta kahit ilang years na yung nakalipas Totoo. from winning the Miss Senior, Binibining Pilipinas all together with my co-queens. Uh, sobrang maraming pa rin um, nagtatanong ko ano yung mga nagbibigay ng events sa akin. Um, alam mo yun, andito pa rin tayo sa industriya, Totoo. which means that we are still relevant and we can still do more for the people that we inspire. Oh, taray, simula pa lang yun, ah. And I thank, thank you. Thank you, parang always your first one talaga. <laughs> Pero ito nga, since malapit na ang araw ng mga puso, we have a little challenge for you. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Are you game? So here's... Are you ready? Yes, you <laughs> are ready. Ako ready na ako ipagkasalit, ah. <laughs> Ito, here's the mechanics. We will be showing you two random pictures of every round. And all you have to do is pick who is you or who do you prefer the most. So for example, itong picture na to, ganyan. Explain mo lang ng konti bakit mo sila yung napili mo. Uh, uh, napili mo. Uh, Ayan. Ganun. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. Are they ready? Yes. <laughs> Let's play Gas Loving. Our first photos. Wow. James Reed or Piolo Pasquale. The OG Piolo Pasquale. All Kasi right. Besides na super mabait, very charming. Okay. Moving on to the next round. Oh, Piolo Pasquale. Ooh. Piolo or Jericho or Salas. Uh, that's, a, that's a really tight competition, pero... <laughs> Hmm, sige, Piolo Pascual. Piolo pa din. Yes. Okay. Third photo. Ooh, Derek Monasterio or Piolo Pascual? I will still go for Papa P. Yes! <laughs> Just moving on to the next round, Papa P. Let's go. Let's go. Alden Richards or Piolo Pascual? Papa P. Aba, gano'ng maka semi-finalist si Papa P. <laughs> Let's right. go. Fifth photo, Ken Suson or Piolo Oy, Pascual? Ken Suson, Bisaya. Yes. Bisaya. Wow, proud um, Bisaya here. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Di ba naalala ko sinabi mo, favorite mo yung oh, sogabi? Oo, oo nga. Ano, kantayin natin. Wala, so, wala. 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 baka maka-operate tayo. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sige, baka pagbayaran tayo. Oh, okay. okay, G. Piolo Pascual. Okay, yes. Piolo Pascual. Sixth photo. Enrique Hill or Piolo Pascual? Baka, ah, ito yung medyo tight for me. Oo nga. Eh, Inihin naman ako yung guess. Wait, makapagalitan ako ni Liza Saberana. Piolo Pascual pa rin. Piolo Pascual pa rin. And this is the moment of truth. 
Yes? One by one, two by two. Margo Gumaba or Piolo Pascual? Tutropahin? Nor? Miss Wong, ito na yung crowning moment. Piolo Pascual! Yes! yes! Started from Piolo the bottom. Pas- Now we're here. Yes! <laughs> At kinuranahan na nga po talaga ni Gizini, Piolo Pascual. Papa P forever. Papa P. Baka naman may gusto kong message kay Papa P. Papa P, sana ay makalaw. Thank you na. <laughs> Uy, malay mo, babe. Hindi mo sure. That will be the highlight of my year talaga if that happens to me. Baka naman. Sana mag-di lang ang hell ka, I-attract babe. I-attract natin yes, yan, babe. Yes, the manifestation. Yes. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much, success. Yes. And thank you for being so game. Ito naman, we will now move on to our kwentuhan. We are four days away to the Valentine's Day season, and of course, how are you planning to celebrate this day? And do you have any plans to celebrate this day? Valentine's Day usually is for my mom. No, because my mom has wala siyang wala yung dad ko for the longest time, so wala siyang kasama during Valentine's Day. So for me to show her the love, I give her minsan flowers mm-hmm. or just to be there with her. Basically, and this year for me is focusing on myself and family and loved ones. So, yeah, I will most definitely celebrate it with my mom. Oh, is it a tradition for you? Na talagang kayo when, bonding when I was oh oh, ginagawa ko na siyang parang oh oh as much as possible for lahong ginagawa. Mm-hmm. Pagkaya talaga. talaga ako, oh, oh. I think it's really in our age, no? Mm-hmm. Na parang we're making up for the lost yes. times, and as long as we can right now, yes. talagang gagawin natin. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So babe, ano ba yung pinaka-memorable mong pagsa-celebrate ng Valentine's Day at sino yung kasama mo? Uh, most memorable ko siguro... Um, Ayaw sabihin! Nag-iisip! Nag-iisip pa ka kasi! Yung last one, meron ba? Everything yung naman is sabihin. memorable for <laughs> me! Ang <laughs> pageant! Huwag lang ko ba? Hindi naman kailangan uh-huh. Valentine's Day lang babe. Yeah. Okay lang din naman na. Kasi ma- Valentine's Day is a man-made celebration for me every day with your loved ones is a special day. Oh. Oh, sige, yung ano na lang parang memorable day mo na nag-celebrate ka ng love with your family okay. or friends. Love. Siguro usually pag nagbe-birthday ako kasi us- uh, usually yung mga tao umuwi talaga sa mga probinsya nila. So I appreciate those people who who just comes to my birthday party kasi 26 after Christmas yun eh. So, oh, diba, imagine lahat sila being torn uh, being torn between going to my birthday or going home to your family. So, yun talaga na-appreciate ko yung mga taong nakakaalala din ng birthday ko. Oh. Ito naman, going back to pageants naman tayo, konting chika. You were tagged as one of the prettiest face. And for me, like the most pretty wow, Miss babe, Universe. Totoo. I told you. Oh. I told you already, diba? Kinakalimutan ko kasi. Oh, diba? Hindi ko kasi. Hindi na kalimutan niya. Ganun siya eh. Hindi, joke lang. Hindi, naaalala ko kasi, ito may disclaimer na naman tayo. Oh. <laughs> naaalala ko kasi si Gazini, pag pumupunta sa bus ng Minimini Pilipinas, walang make-up. Tapos ako naka-contact lens, naka-lashes, nakakulong. Lakado! Tapos parang oh. ako, minumura mo ba kami ng ganda mga bus? Parang, ano sugat? Ano na natin to si Gazini? Sleep is life kasi talaga. Tapos gaganyan lang siya. <laughs> Tapos mag-open na siya. Tapos siya nakakuha ng award. Nagigil <laughs> talaga kami. Pero alam talaga namin na you were one of the most oh, beautiful. And you. also together with Bim din. Pero I'm, iba talaga yung ganda mo eh. Kasi pang universe talaga. Oh, thank you, babe. Um, may pang gigigil yun. <laughs> kasi parang... Hindi sa bulat mi read ba? <laughs> Hindi kasi talagang you were tagged as one of the prettiest face for Miss Universe. Until now, honestly, I have the imposter syndrome. When it comes to pe- when people tells me that oh you're you're the prettiest, I tend to I'm shy away from believing it. But instead, I say thank you in in respect naman. But minsan you get to ask yourself, totoo ba talaga? Because like there are so many beautiful women, right? Before me and after me, who caters differently. Mm-hmm. Yung assets nila, may charming, may beautiful. Iba iba kasi yung classing yes. ganda. Yes. Ako naman, medyo oh, more on seductive. Ganit, yeah. Yung narinig ko, ha? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ano lang to, para lang to sa ating mga viewers at sambayan na, na nare-receive mong comments. Oo, pero I am honored and grateful that people appreciate my beauty in that way. Siguro I'll explain it. Kaya feeling ko, ikaw yung parang most pretty face sa Miss Universe. It's because 
um, yung face mo kasi parang pwede siya sa Asian, pwede sa mga Latina, pwede sa Amerika, pwede dito sa Philippines. Eh, eh. Yung parang hindi mo mahulaan eh. kung anong race ka. And that's why for me, yung curiosity na yun, yun mas lalo nagpapaganda sa beauty mo. That's for me lang. Ako lang naman po ay, <laughs> ano ko lang naman to. So yun. Okay. Pero ngayon na narealize ko na ang tatanong ko sana, is there a pretty privilege for you? Or dahil doon nagkaroon ka ng imposter syndrome? Um, well, meron yes, there is. Uh, especially if you look kind of different. People might think na, ay, English era to. Uh, ano, like, we'll give them. Kasi as hospitality, with us Filipino, we're very hospitable. Yeah. When we see someone from outside the country or a foreigner, so if we see someone like a foreigner, we ultimately caters them to the hospitality that we have as Filipino. So, yes, it it also affects, like, kunyari, if, ano, if nalita ho, mm-hmm. oh, sorry, it, it, they Para already... Para okay na lahat. Oh, <laughs> Pero oh. hindi rin kasi with the background, my celebrity, if you're a celebrity, they also try to accommodate you more because of the services that they want you to experience. So um, sometimes, yes, it it kind of varies to a particular person if they're very VVIP. Hmm. So minsan, nakakatulong din talaga Oo, siya. Oo, minsan. Pero and wag naman tayong maging ano. Maging abusado. Abusado. Yes. Na kunyari, ay, I'm this and that. Na magiging mahangin ka na. Hmm. So, and for sure, we join a beauty pageant and that's why talagang advantage siya. Yes. Kasi we're physique talaga. Doon talaga tayo magkukot ng attention. And sometimes agad. it's also earned, not given, babe. Totoo. Yes. Bakit po pinapangukaw? We, we <laughs> deserve naman natin to. Deserve natin yes. to. Ganyan. Uh-oh. Ito naman, um, is it okay yung itakal natin yung about sure. imposter syndrome mo? Uh, sure. Of okay course. That's, sure a, that's a very important yeah, issue. Kasi yes. parang napansin ko, halos lahat ng Miss Universe may ganun. Oh, okay. Wait, i-recap mo nga ako. Para sa mga sambayanan na hindi alam yung imposter syndrome, ano yun, babe? And kaya mo bang explain sa kanila? Yes. Imposter syndrome is something that people... Uh, highly think of you like kunyari, uh, Miss Universe you're the Miss Universe you're the prettiest but then you yourself don't believe in that thought so you have um, this hesitation or you have this thoughts that is pessimistic towards being beautiful yourself so it's just like negativity sometimes when you talk to yourself you don't talk to yourself like the way they talk they talk to no, you yeah or the way they compliment you means and there are always negative th- thoughts that creeps in your mind am i really capable is this really is this really my life i think i'm living the life of someone else's this is not who i am oh my god ganyan, ganon, meron ganon, babe. so I, I researched on it and i was like ah oh, meron palang tawag yung feelings and emotion oh na i feel ko and when i talk to other beauty queens uh, like the ones that really thrive like, yeah. in the pageantry Industry era, also. they also have the same experience like a ptsd yeah. post traumatic syndrome yeah. or like um, they just feel like they're an imposter in their lives that they don't deserve the things that they earned oh my gosh do you feel this after you won or when I had a lot of bashers before, sometimes when I read comments, so hindi na ako nagbabasa ng comments, up until now, nadala ko na what? siya ng habit. Yes. Um, because... Um, hindi na pala ako magko-comment sa'yo. Hindi <laughs> 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 ka naman nagko-comment sa'yo. Hindi 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 nagko-comment Hindi lang eh. <laughs> Sige. Tapos, ayun babe, pag minsan, um, nagbabasa naman ako minsan na kasi naka-recover na tayo doon. Okay. Nabit. So, it was like 2019 ago. Yeah. Parang <laughs> 2019 ago. 2019 ago. Siguro yung parang hindi na lang yung lagi-lagi and recent. Oo. Okay. So, kasi when people are bashing you or pushing negative nar- narratives towards you and your family, even when you sleep at night, at the end of the day, you still get to think about it. You're like, oh, I'm just gonna brush it up. It's, mm-hmm. wala, hindi naman yan makakatulong sa, sa pinagdadaanan ko. Pero you're still gonna think about it at the end of the day. So sometimes it's really nice to just think twice to what you comment towards other people. And be kind. It's a general manner to be always be kind and be thoughtful with, with regards to what you are saying towards one another. Hmm. How did you overcome this imposter syndrome? Um, I did you talk to uh, therapist a therapist or, or ganyan? Hindi, babe. Uh, I just went back to my family. Okay. And sometimes they just keep you grounded. Mm-hmm. And they remind you of what your purpose is, no matter how successful you are. 
sometimes it's just a calling for you to go back to to the Lord mm-hmm. or just pray, pray and pray Totoo. until that you find your sense of purpose again and come back to life. Oh, kasi at the end of the all the glitz and the glamour, yes. babalik talaga tayo yes. sa family, no? And sila talaga, like for example, especially our moms, sila yes. yung mas nakakakilala sa atin na, oh my God, sanggol pa lang tayo. Yes. Alam nila yung fears natin. Yes. Bago pa na-appreciate ng iba yung ganda us. nila. Yes. Ganda natin. Yes. Nagaganda na sila sa atin. Yes. Oh. Oo. Oh, oh. Ang ganda nun. Wait lang. Nakama ko. Uy, nga! <laughs> Kasi grabe, lahat talaga ng mga tao na experience yan. Oo. Hindi ko rin yan na experience pero. <laughs> Ang ganda mo, babe. Mahama ng buo. Ikaw mo to mamaya. Ni, isalin niyo. Is ang ganda, grabe. Ikaw yung prettiest talaga, babe. Hindi <laughs> vibra <laughs> rock na lang you. Babe, bulag lang talaga. Love is blind kasi Love daw. It. Alam mo kasi, oh, sabi nga, yung blind. ganda daw, minsan uso, minsan hindi. Oh, oh. So, medyo nauuso yung ganda ko noong pandemic. Ayun, oh, oh. na-late lang ng konti. Like skyrocket ka naman dun, babe. So, bumawin <laughs> naman. <laughs> Nag-ROI naman tayo. Thank babe. you, babe. <laughs> ROI. <laughs> Feeling mo, Bobby, what is the biggest misconception about beauty queens? Uh, that we're always beautiful every day. Hmm. Na, meron naman isang araw na masakit yung puson mo kasi nag-PMS ka pala. Tapos magulo yung buhok mo. Tapos naka-chanelas ka lang, punta ka ng mall. And then they're like, oh, hindi pala siya ganun kagandahan. Ganun kasi hindi ka lang plakado. Hmm. Pero um, siguro nakakalimutan nilang normal, normal din tayo. Normal din tayo. Oo, we're still human ourselves. <laughs> um, yes, nag-chanelas kami. Hindi kami nag-wear ng makeup. Magulo yes. yung buhok so, namin. Lahat na naiisip niyo, oh, ginagawa din oh, namin oh. yun. <laughs> Early in the morning, mga ganun. <laughs> Oo, so yun lang. Um, hindi naman kailangan palaging maganda ka. It's the beauty towards your authenticity talaga. Mm-hmm. Ayan. Ito naman, when it comes to love, ano yung experience mo na talagang mapapasabi ka, ay, shocks, ang ganda ko pala talaga. Yung naniwala ka na you feel special and nasabi mo mismo sa sarili mo, ang ganda ko pala. Winkily. Yung hinintay ako for almost a year, To, to be a girlfriend to someone. <laughs> Alay, I know. Yung hinintay ako, yung, yung, yung patience, yung um, consistency, dun ako nagagandahan sa sarili ko na, ay, worth it pala talaga ako. Oh, of course you are. Oh, of course, everyone is yeah. worth it. In their own ways naman. Pero so, yun lang talaga yung parang nagpakilig sa iyo. Oh, oh, okay. Na, parang worth it pala talaga akong hintayin. Yeah. Parang, oo, oh, oh, ganun. Oh. Oh. Is there something about love na pinapaniwalaan before and then nabali yung perception mo na hindi mo na siya pinapaniwalaan na mm. Yes, there is. That What is it? Sometimes love doesn't have to end beautifully. Sometimes, sometimes it doesn't end as the way that you want it to be. But sometimes um, you have to go through it to be able to learn a lesson and Next time, if someday you guys will be meant together, then it will just happen. Oh, ganda no. They will. Oh, wait, wait lang. lang a moment of silence. Hindi kasi yes. alam mo, nakilala ko din si Gazini, isa siya sa mga very loving person. Sa mga hindi nakakaalam, talagang lagi siya nagpe-prepare ng baon niya. Yes. Tapos minsan, <laughs> lagi pa siya nagpe-prepare ng baon para sa iba. Ninadagdagan niya talaga yung baon. Yes. Kahit kami, hindi na kami kumakain. Tapos minsan, talagang siya binip... Mini make sure niya na may pagkain. Yun yun na appreciate ko talaga, talaga sa iyo. guys. Yeah, kasi nung una Slap sabi person. ko, ay parang ano to, padagdag points lang to. Joke ay, lang. Ay, grabe. Hindi, hindi joke lang. Ang three points mo para kay Samantha. <laughs> hindi. <laughs> hindi kasi nung una, super random. As in everyday siya may pagkain. Sabi ko, grabe, parang handa handa to. Eh, sobrang hunger na tayo nun, uh, di ba? Right. Pero na-realize ko sa camp, ganun talaga siya. And we train together. So Uh-oh. I know na ganun ka talaga, na genuine Uh-oh. ka talaga. But syempre for other girls na hindi natin nakasama, malagi na parang parang aktibo to si ate girl parang gano'n that's nice naman babe that you yeah. notice that wala well, of course na notice ko talaga ako yeah hindi kasi tsaka also naalala ko diba pinatira ka dun ni Emma oh, even oh. mommy G talagang uh-uh. sinasabi talaga na you are really love, lovable person and even sila mama Drew hmm. talagang lahat sila wala talaga sila Nakakaya, masabi no? sa ugali thank you babe thank you sa lahat ng mga taong feeling nila, syempre ngayong Valentine's Day, malungkot sila or mag-isa sila, ano naman yung gusto mong sabihin? Oh. Kasi syempre, di ba? That's really sad. Oo, not everyone oh. kasi gets to celebrate. Oh. Well, if you are lonely, um, there's a difference kasi between being alone and being lonely. So, parang, um, 
sometimes you're alone but you enjoy your own company. Yes. Sometimes you're alone but you're with other you're alone together with other people. So, kunyari, you're in a house with your family. So, mm-hmm. that's also one way to celebrate Valentine's. It's not just only for people who are lovers. They are also a celebration of love towards your family, friends, and loved ones. So, um, you don't have to be alone this or lonely this Valentine's Day. You can be alone and still thriving in your own comfort zone. Aww, and I thank you. And I think, kung baga celebrate yourself pa yes, and love yourself yes, pa in your own way. It can yes. be like watching Netflix, yes. diba, eating ice cream, yes. or anything that Do will make you happy. makes you happy. Yeah. Aww. Then naman, we're always talking about love. Yes. Pero, Ano ba sa'yo yung parang red flags talaga sa isang guy na ngayon na negotiable mo na as you grow older? Red flags. Yung hindi, yung center of attention niya is God. Yun, yun yung red flag ko. Kasi if you don't have your faith towards God, how can I make sure that you are a vessel of His love towards other people? <laughs> Bin, na proud ako talaga. Kasi God talaga is the center Bin, of totoo. everything, de ba? Even between relationships. <laughs> Wait, tuto matao siya. Ako yah. Nina, na ako is kasi ako igazini. Parang oh. bim, parang pang Miss Universe ko pa talaga. <laughs> Nid ako na nini wala ako don. Kasi parang with Scott kasi parang hindi siya lumakay na may religion. Pero now we're praying every night, and then he's reading your devotional books. We also have our spiritual web mentor. So, parang we really work on our spirituality. And lagi ko nga sinasabi na parang God should be the center of our relationship. Na parang triangle talaga yes. siya. Kasi whatever happens, I want a godly man na I alam ko, hindi niya gagawin yung masama. Yes. Inuunahin niya pa din yung kung ano yung makakabuti. And you feel safe, di ba? Yes, oo. So, yun lang. Oh, godly man, nakakatawa. Ito naman, do you believe in second chances? And do you think that love is enough to change a person for better if nagkamali siya? I do believe in second chances, but I don't believe in third chances. Okay, <laughs> same, same, same. Okay, so yeah, at least nagka ano tayo. So, on Bakit? the same level. Bakit? Bakit? Because even God himself, diba, forgave us with all our sins. Even if we continuously do it all over again, so who am I to decline a forgiveness to someone who I love dearly? But the third time you do it at the same time, it's on me. <laughs> kasalanan ko na, hindi niya na kasalanan. But yun lang, on the third time that you do it all over again, it's done, it's over. But I believe in second chances and and everyone has the chance to to prove to themselves that they are not who they were once. Yeah. Who they are not their past. <laughs> And that doesn't define their future. Mm-hmm. Yeah, ako din naniniwala ako. Pero sometimes, minsan hindi enough yung reason na yon para magbago talaga yung isang tao. So sila Depends talaga yung on the gravity yeah. of the situation. Totoo. Kung gaano ka lalim yung kasalanan ng tao. Yeah, at kung gaano din kalalim yung pinagsamahan din yes. siguro nila. Ganyan. Yes. Pero yun na hindi ako naniniwala na parang enough na mahal ng isang tao yung isang tao para magbago siya kasi kailangan mas mahal niya yung sarili niya para yes. magbago siya that's right ang mm. ganda nun oh thank you baby pang Miss Universe pwede sa ano huwag ang ganyan mamaya maaaral naman tayo dito galawin muna ang baso basagin natin yung plan eto pero sa lahat ng mga relationship paano mo ba malalaman na it's enough enough is enough yeah ang hirap nun eh kasi minsan Ta- ako tayo, minsan iniisip nila na, oh, okay lang yan, makakahanap naman kayo, maganda kayo, ganyan and all. Pero sometimes we also have that um, feeling na parang we get to stick with the relationship na parang feeling natin hindi na tayo matatanggap ng iba, ng ganito. Pero nabubulag tayo yes. sa love idea na love. Na yes. love to, na love to. Yes. So, hindi lang tayo, lahat tayo na yes. experience natin yan. Yes. So when do you say for you, love is enough and it's too much pain, so dapat to Enough pain. is enough. When it enough is enough is when you cannot sleep at night because you think you're with the wrong person. Oh, okay. <laughs> enough is enough is when you think that you are not yourself anymore. You cannot you cannot recognize yourself anymore because you kept changing yourself for that particular person who was the one needed for the change that 
was happening. Oh, ang ganda noon. Wala mm-hmm. na akong madadagdag. Mm-hmm. And I, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Ito yeah. na lang, to, to have the last question. Yes. Ano yung definition ng isang Gazini Ganados sa panahon ngayon? Ano ang love para sa'yo? Love for me is... That, that's such a deep word talaga, yeah, love. Yeah, kasi di ba parang every oh, season oh. of our life, nag-iiba oh, yung definition yes. natin ng love. Yes. And for this season of your life, ano yung definition mo ng love? Definition ko is unconditional. So, no matter what you go through, um, the unconditional love is still there. Oh, so without expectation, yes. you're giving it to the other person without yes. anything from return. Yes. Yun yung unconditional yes. love. Ang ganda uh-huh. nun. Um, thank you, thank babe. Thank you, babe. Ano ba? Wait, wait, wait. Kuya, kami na gano'n. Kaya, kung ito ako sa Grabe, okay. sobrang ang dami ko natutunan. And may ako gusto din. ko ba mag add or something? Wala na, okay na. Sa isang movie na napanood ko, sabi doon na may tatlong tao daw tayong klase na namimit sa isang buhay natin. We met for a reason, for a season, and for a lifetime. Naniniwala ka ba doon? Ngayon ko lang narinig yan, babe. <laughs> Talaga? Yes! Oh, so, oh. ibig sabihin nun, may mga tao daw na ako, ah, personally, yung first ko, parang naisip ko, tunuruan niya ako paano magmahal. Oh. Yung second ko, parang kailangan naming pagdaanan lahat ng mga pagnagdaanan namin because it's for a season, kailangan ko siya. Oh. And now, Scott is my lifetime. Oh. So, yun. So, nakatatlo ka, babe? Nakatatlo, uh, babe. Pasok sa mga top three! <laughs> Ikaw ba? Top three, Di bro. Di pa na-experience yun. Um, naka-isa pa lang ako, babe. Ay, naka-isa ka pa lang. <laughs> uh, so, siguro a reason muna ako. Then, to to be assigned, to assignment ko na yung season. season and then and maybe a lifetime. Yeah, so oh, I will no. get back with you. Yes. <laughs> so, another season for us, for another season. <laughs> Update. Yes. yes. Okay, ito naman. We have another challenge for you for 20 questions and you need to answer this as much as you can para naman ang sambenan mas makilala nila ikaw. Yes. All right. How fast can you answer 20 questions? Timer starts now. Your favorite song? Um, all we have is now. Your favorite movie? Uh... <laughs> um, um, hindi ko na alam, nag-block out na ako. Wait lang. Three okay lang yan, okay lang yan. Oh my gosh. Um, forks over knives. Your favorite color? Sky blue. Your favorite food? Inununan. Oh, did you? Anyway, dream destination. Egypt. Favorite actor? Chris Hemsworth. Ultimate crush? Wala. <laughs> Favorite drink? <laughs> Favorite drink? Um, um, Buku juice. I think in your bag. Lipstick. <laughs> your role model? My mother. A book you read? Day dash. A must have when you travel? Neck pillow. <laughs> greatest phobia. Your greatest movie? Um, Celine phobia. Uh, phobia. Um, um, or claustrophobia. Fear. Okay. Greatest pet to you? Um, chewing when your mouth is open. Your favorite app? <laughs> <laughs> favorite app? Um, messenger. Your recommended TV series? Um, game changer. First thing you do when you wake up? Drink water. Last thing you do before sleeping? Uh, first thing you do when you wake up? Open my eyes! <laughs> <laughs> Last thing you do before sleeping. To be more, pray to God. Ah, no, close my eyes. <laughs> a hobby you wanted to start. What is A hobby you wanted to start. Iron Man. Um, ah. Triathlete. Oh, wow. Okay. Your greatest wish? For Palestine to be free. Uh, time stop? One minute and 56 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. No, Lamang na! For the first time, may mas matagal na sa aking guest! Yay! <laughs> Oy, may may mas na ba ako sa'yo, babe? Oy, hindi! Ako, ang tagal ko talaga! Ah, Ay, matagal pa rin ako. 
Hindi, joke lang pala. Mas matagal pa rin pala. Ah, okay. Diba? Ikaw pa rin yung winner. Yes! Oh. Season ko to. Ako pa rin mo yung nag-first try. Ako din yung, ano, kulela. Winner. Oh. Pero ito, babe. Ano ba yung, um, yung sinabi mo favorite food? Inununan. Ano yun? A, I don't know if it's a delicacy in other um, provinces, but in Cebu, it's uh, simmered vinegar and fish. So, para siyang may okra, may fish. Para siyang... Kin- ba- si- paksiyo. Paksiyo, paksiyo, pero may okra. May okra, oh. may talong. Hala, hindi ko ba na-try yan? But simmered. Sige, pa-try kita pag punta mo sa Cebu. Uh-uh. Okay. Para siyang sinigang. Okay. Na, pero hin- wala yung powder na sinigang. Oh, wow. Parang vinegar lang yung ginagamit, babe. Parang masarap. Parang paksiyo. Oo, oh, oh, so we risk So, okra lang tsaka talong. Talong tsaka okay. fish and then Nagutong magluto tayo. Nagutong tayo. <laughs> yeah, pwede, pwede. Sa pwede vlog mo. Sinigang. Or sa content mo. Wala akong vlog. Wala akong vlog. Eh. Okay Ikaw lang, babe. Oh, sige, sige. <laughs> Ikaw na lang. Yeah, yeah. Tawag dito. Meron pa siya isang sinabi. Oo. Oh. Hindi, wala. Iron Man. Iron After Man. After na wedding ko, yeah. Iron Man. Hindi mo alam. Na, oh, oh. Pero hindi Punta ako nag-train ngayon. Uh, Wish lang, babe. <laughs> Wish. A hobby Sayang. that I want to. Oo, oh, oh, okay, that okay. I wanted to start. Pero I'm doing swimming, um, biking, and then practicing now with my running. So, okay. parang, I'm... I'm sure you can do hopefully, it. Hopefully, 2025. Yeah. Para tuloy-tuloy lang talaga yung training kailangan. Oo, oh, oh. kasi training needs six months. Oh, At parang least six din. months. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Grabe oh. yung ibang level yung training. Basically. Okay, para matapos na ito. Hindi pala tayo tapos. Thank you so much, guys. Thank Ayan. you for having me. And happy Valentine's Day to everyone. Yes, pero ito last na lang. Yes. Talaga. We will give advice to one person na nagtanong doon sa aking IG Sam Sentiments Broadcast. Ito, sabi niya, how do you set healthy boundaries? Mm. How do you Paano set? Paano nga ba? Ang hirap. Uh, uh, practice the act of saying no because sometimes saying no is not is not uh, you're not declining for them. You're declining for your own mental health or for your own um, personal reasons. Sometimes declining is the best way to do rather than ditching them because you didn't really want to go. Exactly. Siguro akin naman, setting healthy boundaries is parang really knowing what you want. Yeah. Kasi you can never say no pag hindi mo alam yung gusto mo. Mm-hmm. Eh. Sometimes nadadala ka lang, di ba? Oo, go with the flow. Pag hindi mo alam yung gusto Uh-oh. mo. So, setting healthy boundaries is also knowing yourself and knowing what you want. Yes. 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 There you have it! Thank you so much, Kazini. Baka naman may gusto kang i-promote sa ating mga viewers at sambayanan. Okay. Hi, everyone. It's Gazini Ganados. And don't forget to follow me on my social pages, Gazini Ganados. And I will see you around. Yes, thank you so much, babe, for thank being you, babe. here. Thank you, I know sobrang oh, busy ka. Ang dami schedule. So, thank you, thank you thank so you, much. Thank you, babe. I love you so much. Be happy, be hopeful, and be grateful. That wraps up the sum up. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Next week on the summer. Pangarap mo ba talaga na magkaroon ng platform or maging celebrity? Oh my gosh! Actually, I've always wanted to put myself out there. That's why I started YouTube as my first way of putting myself out there. and Miss Universe 2019 Top 20 sa- Ang hubo na rin lakat. Tawa ang hubo na. Oh, sige. Ulitin ko ba? Oh, wait, wait lang. Hindi ako na ready. Hindi ako na ready. Hindi ako na ready. Ganun siya yung mga favorite song. Okay, sige. Okay, sige. When we see someone from outside the country or a foreign... Uy, ang ingay niyo. Wait lang. Ang ingay niyo, guys.